more children? How many more children, Prime Minister? Are we going to do something? I came here to pay my respects to the victims and families who are going through raw pain and grief that most of us can't imagine, I can't imagine as a dad myself. To get a briefing from the Chief Constable and the emergency services about the ongoing investigation. But also importantly, to have the opportunity to say to those that were responding yesterday from the emergency services, to say a personal thank you to them and to shake their hand and to say that as Prime Minister, on behalf of the country, we are grateful for what they did. They, of course, say that they will respond, they're professionals, to anything, but there's no pretending that what they had to respond to yesterday was ordinary. It was very, very difficult of them. Uh, they were absolutely professional, and it was important for me to come and say simple words, thank you. I think it touches a nerve with the whole country. Um, it's awful to contemplate what happened, to hear for myself the experiences of the first responders, what they had to deal with. Um, it's really hard to take in for anybody. It's not what any of them uh, came to work for, but of course they're professionals and they deal with it. Um, I think about the families, um, the friends, the loved ones, those directly impacted, and of course the wider community here. But um, there's no pretending, I think, that anybody in the country is not untouched by what happened yesterday. I just want to say a personal thank you to each of you. That's why I wanted to shake each of your hands for what you did yesterday. I'm incredibly proud of what you've done. I'm amazed but not surprised that you're in today, carrying on with your duties. I really want you to focus on the fact that there are children today alive because of what you did yesterday. That is incredible. It's what you do every day, but it's the most difficult of circumstances. And I don't want you to think for a minute that the rest of the country has not seen that. And I speak as Prime Minister on behalf of the whole country. And by shaking your hand, I'm doing it on behalf of everybody in this country.